Good day everyone, your sock monkey here. Today I've got a video for you of a 2011 BMW X5 diesel. I've been a big fan of these SUVs for a while, just really like the way that they looked. Um, and this was the first SUV that BMW brought onto the scene back in, I believe it was like 2001, um, before they passed our line and pretty much became crossovers in SUVs. So here you have your projector beam headlamps, HIDs, and then your lights down below. Um, washer fluid or uh, headlamp washers your kidney grills before they became obnoxious kidney grills very nice 19 inch wheels on the vehicle this is the x drive 35d so it has a I believe it's a three liter diesel six, six cylinder has your shifter and your i drive controller light interior sport wheel um no pet no pedal shifters I can see push button start your iDrive controller in the center uh, stereo and like I said I drive in the center automatic parking brake I believe these had a third row has rear um, air vents and everything I believe these had a third row yes it does and it's a very small third row I think it's really only just for kids so coming around to the back x5 it's only those badges on the sides that really give it away that it's a diesel. These also came in, I believe, in line six, and these also came in a V8 as well. In those in those years, diesel cap, diesel only, misfueling restrictor installed, which I think what that means is they've changed the nozzle a little bit so you can't, so you don't try so you don't try to put in the wrong fuel by mistake so you don't try to put gas into this by mistake and i think they've also like i, I know like if you try to put in a diesel in certain cars nowadays it, it won't fit. in gas cars the nozzles are designed so that they will only fit so there's your there's your little factoid of the day here people nice little european style things on the side your bmw rondel so I thank you guys for watching and take care.